Somewhere around the 90s to the early 2000s, there was a new operating system that Microsoft was working on in secret. The code name for the new system was London, named after the capital of England, and the company had high hopes for it to be the most advanced and user-friendly OS ever created, possibly for users from the United Kingdom. However, something sinister was lurking within the London code. As the release dates drew nearer, strange reports started to come in from Microsoft employees. They reported seeing strange messages popping up on their screens at random times, even when the system was supposed to be in sleep mode. The messages were written in an unknown language, and no one could decipher their meaning. As the launch day approached, the reports became more frequent and disturbing. Some employees claimed to have seen ghostly images flickering on their screens before the messages appeared. Others reported feeling a cold presence in the room, even when they were alone. Despite the growing concerns, Microsoft decided to go ahead with the release of London. The system was a massive success, with millions of people all over the world, including the UK, installing it on their computers. But soon, they too began to experience the strange messages and ghostly images. As the weeks went by, the messages became, again, more frequent and way more sinister. Some users claimed to have received threats, while others reported seeing disturbing images of death and destruction. The London operating system had taken on a life of its own, and it seemed to be determined to spread its malevolent influence to as many people as possible. In the end, Microsoft was forced to recall London, and the company never spoke of it again. But some say that the London code lives on, hidden deep within the darkest corners of the internet. And if you're not careful, it may just find its way onto your computer, bringing with it a world of terror and darkness that you may never escape.